Tilton Railway Cutting is the Leicestershire and Rutland Wildlife Trust Nature Reserve of national importance for its geology. Descending into the cutting reveals a steep rock face, the remains of a Jurassic world from 185 million years ago, when what is now Britain was covered by a warm tropical sea. As the sea shallowed, sand, silt and minerals were deposited to produce the layers of sedimentary rock visible today, along with the fossilised remains of the animals which once lived there. At the base of the cliff are the oldest rocks, belonging to the Durham Formation and characterised by fossils of the Ammonite Amalfius. Above this is the milestone rock bed, the lowest 2.45 metres being a sandy ironstone, above which there is 0.45 metres of green oolitic limestone. The final 3 metres are ironstone and it is within this layer that the Ammonite Tiltonicerus acutum is found, a species named after this locality. Within the rocks are densely packed clusters of brachiopod fossils, animals with hinged shells. As you travel southwards along the formal railway line, the milestone beds tilt downwards so that progressively younger rocks approach the floor of the cutting. The rusty stains associated with the vertical joins and bedding planes are films of iron minerals deposited by water seeping out of the ironstone. A rise in sea level brought ironstone deposition to an end and resulted in the formation of a 9 metre thick layer of grey shales and clays, known as the Whitby Mudstone Formation. This is revealed halfway along the cutting by a large landslip. Heavy rain and waterlogging destabilised the shale and clay, resulting in it sliding down to the former track bed, bringing trees and shrubs which once lined the bank with them. The boundary between the milestone and Whitby mudstone is exposed further along. The crumbly grey shales contain fossils of bivalves and of ammonites, including Dactylicerus. Ammonites are extinct marine mollusks which had flat spiral shells which inside were divided into chambers by septa. Ammonites lived between 240 and 65 million years ago and became extinct at the end of the Cretaceous period at the same time as the dinosaurs. Their nearest living relatives are cephalopods such as octopus, squid, cuttlefish and nautilus. The walk through the Jurassic ends as the cutting opens out at the far end of the reserve. Tilting cutting is open to the public. When visiting, please be aware of the steep and unstable cliffs, especially when examining the rock faces. You may look for fossils in the spoil and scree, but please do not hammer at the bedrock, as the site is a site of special scientific interest. For more information about Tilton Railway Cutting, visit our website at www.lrwt.org.uk.